everyone welcome back to Technon Tech TV in this tutorial I will show you how to draw an ER diagram for hotel management system so if you don't know what is ER diagram and what are the components of ER diagram then I have added the video link uh, on the upper right corner of your screen so watch that video first ER diagram for hotel management system shows all the visual instrument of database tables and the relationships between rooms payments hotel customer etc so here i am taking only six entities hotel room employee customer today price and payment now let's see the relationship between all these entities first let's see the relationship between hotel and employee so employee works for hotel and next hotel owns rooms next we have entity customer and room so customer check in and check out in hotel room and customer also check and reserves a room according to today's price and once customer book their room they have to make payment so i am adding make relationship between customer and payment so customer make payment so these are the relationships which i have defined in these six entities here we can also add specialization so for employee entity i am adding specialization specialization is a top down approach in specialization one higher level entity can be broken down into two lower level entities so if you don't know about specialization and generalization concept then i have added the video link in the upper right corner of your screen so click on that link and watch that video first so there can be different employees who working in hotel so i am adding three important employees admin who manage everything receptionist and room service i am also adding a specialization for entity room there can be different types of room available in hotel so i am adding two categories one is classic and another one is deluxe room now let's see the cardinality ratio between these entities so many employees works for one hotel and one hotel owns many rooms next one or many customer check in and check out in one or more than one room and uh, one customer reserves many room according to the today's price and one customer can make multiple payment right so this is the cardinality ratio between these entities now come to the attribute so for entity hotel i am adding three attributes hotel id hotel name and location and hotel id is the key attribute here next we have entity employee for this first attribute is employee id and employee id is the key attribute here next is employee name job description and contact number and we have used multi valued attribute for contact number because one user can have various contact numbers right and last is attribute address next we have entity room so for this i am adding three attributes room number room type and room status and room number is the key attribute here next let's see the attribute for entity customer so first is customer id this is the key attribute and second attribute is name so here basically i am using composite attribute so we have break down the name attribute into two sub attributes that is first name and last name next is date of birth attribute here user age is a derived attribute as it changes over time and it can be derived from another attribute date of birth next is address attribute here user address is a composite attribute as an address is composed of other attributes such as pin code state city and we have used multi valued attribute for mobile number next is entity today price so this entity is basically to check price of room according to customer selected date here i am adding three attributes price available room and date and price is the key attribute here and last is entity payment for this i have added four attributes payment number payment method payment date and payment amount and here payment number is the key attribute so this is how you can draw an er diagram on different topics so this is just an example you can add various entities and different attributes according to you 
I have also added the playlist in the uh, description and also on the upper right corner of your screen like how you can draw ER diagram on different topics. So that's it for this video. If you have any doubt comment us below and if you found some value in this video then make sure to subscribe to the channel and give me a thumbs up and do share this video with your friends to spread the knowledge and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.